we can prove this uh, question by using constant maximization using Lagrange multiplier. The uh, problem is like this. Divide 24 into 3 parts such that the continued product of the first, first square of the second and cube of the third may be minimum. So, what is the objective function? The objective function is continue, continuous product of first. Suppose the first value is x and you multiply x with the square of the second that is uh, y square. The second value if is y then y square. Then cube of the third. If the third value is z then z cube. So, given the objective function is x, y square, z cube. And the question is divide 24 into 3 parts. That means suppose the 3 parts are x, y and z. So, 20, we have to divide the value of 24 into 3 parts. That is x plus y plus z equal to 24. And this is the constraint or the condition. And uh, we have to find out the value of x, y and z such that, such that if you add x, y and z and that will be equal to 24. And you have to prove it by using constant maximization using Lagrange multiplier. And this is the equation for the constant maximization using Lagrange multiplier that is f x, y, z is equal to f x, y, z plus lambda into phi x y z. Here f x y z that is given x y square z q. This is your objective function and lambda is your Lagrange multiplier and phi x y z that is equal to x plus y plus z that is your uh, constraint or condition and the equation for the constant is x plus y plus z minus 24 is equal to 0. And if you write the Lagrange equation, then this will be equal to f x y z for f x y z you write x y square z q and for phi x y z you write x plus y plus z minus 24. Then how you can find out the maximization uh, or minimization condition? You have to take the uh, partial derivative of the function. Taking the partial derivative of f with respect to x to 0, if you take the partial derivative of x y square z q with, uh, with respect to x, that will be equal to y square z q plus lambda partial derivative of this value equation will be equal to 1. So, plus lambda equal to 0. So, lambda will be equal to minus y square z q. Suppose this is equation number 1. If you take the partial derivative of f with respect to y, then this, that will be equal to 2y. You, if you take the partial derivative of this, it will be equal to 2y x z q plus lambda that will be equal to 0. So, lambda will be equal to minus 2y x z q. Suppose this is equation number 2. And if you take partial derivative of this function with respect to z, that will be equal to 3z square x y square. So, 3z square plus x y square plus what will be the partial derivative of this with respect to z that will be equal to lambda. So, plus lambda that will be equal to 0. So, lambda will be equal to minus 3z square x y square. Will, that this is equation number 3. So, from equation 1 and 3, 1 and 2, you see uh, left hand side is same. So, minus y square z q that will be equal to minus 2y x z q. So, I have written here from equation 1 and 2 you see uh, minus if minus y square z q will be equal to minus 2y x z uh, q then what will be the value of y? y will be equal to uh, 2x. So, y will be equal to 2x. So, from equation 1 and 3 you see if you equate 1 and 3, then what will be the value of z? z will be equal to 3x. So, using the constraint condition, the given constraint condition is x plus y plus z that will be equal to 24. 
सो इफ यू पोर्ट y इक्वल टू टू एक्स वी हैव फाइंड आउट वाई इक्वल टू टू एक्स सो पोर्ट वाई इक्वल टू टू एक्स एंड जेड इज इक्वल टू थ्री एक्स यूर सो द इक्वेशन विल बी एक्स प्लस टू एक्स प्लस थ्री थ्री एक्स दैट इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फोर सो थ्री प्लस टू फाइव प्लस वन सिक्स सिक्स एक्स इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फोर सो एक्स विल बी इक्वल टू फोर सो इफ यू सब्सटीट्यूट एक्स इक्वल टू फोर हियर वाई विल बी इक्वल टू एट एंड इफ यू पुट्स एक्स इज इक्वल टू फोर हियर जेड विल बी इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व सो इन दिस वे यू कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वाई एंड जेड एंड यू कैन फाइंड आउट हाउ यू डिवाइड ट्वेंटी फोर इंटू थ्री पार्ट सॉज दैट द कंटिन्यूड प्रोडक्ट विल बी कंटिन्यू प्रोडक्ट ऑफ द फास्ट प्लस इंटू स्क्वेर ऑफ द सेकेंड एंड द क्यूब ऑफ द थर्ड टू बी मिनिमम एंड दिस इज दिस इज पॉसिबल बाय यूजिंग कॉन्स्टेंट मैक्सिमाइजेशन यूजिंग लाग्रांच मल्टीप्लायर थैंक यू